And we're back! Hey everyone! Nice to see so many friendly faces here again! My name is Kenan and I'll be your host here today. In today's video, we'll be covering one of the most underrated yet beautiful countries in all of Europe. A nation full of culture, history, and delicious wine, it's the country of Georgia. No, not the state Georgia located in the US, but the little country sitting right below Russia and east of Turkey. Yes, that one. See, you found it. If it's your first time hearing about this European nation, then you are not alone. Even though Georgia is one of the most unique countries and lands, it's relatively unknown to most. Ask any Georgian and they will gladly tell you their country is the home of wine, cheese, and breathtaking Caucasus mountains that protect their lands from high above. A nation of mysterious castles, caves, and its very own one-of-a-kind Georgian pizza called Hachapuri. That's why I'm so excited and thrilled to deliver all the incredible information and fun facts about this small nation. First things first, let's locate this small nation. Grab your globe, your map, or simply Google Georgia country, and let's see where we'll be traveling to today. Located in the Caucasus region of Eastern Europe, Georgia borders Russia on its north side, Turkey on its west, and Azerbaijan on its southeast part. Along with the Black Sea making its far west border, we have just pinpointed this nation. When we say Georgia is a small country, we really do mean it. Georgia stands proud covering around 69,700 square kilometers or 26,911 square miles of land. Its capital city of Tbilisi is the largest, bounding around 726 square kilometers or 280 miles. Georgia has a population of around 4 million people, most living in the capital city of Tbilisi. With 2021 estimates, Georgia's nationwide population ranks on the 128th spot out of the 195th nations of the world, which is why it's sometimes so rare to cross paths with a Georgian. But if you do have the chance, then you should feel honored, as Georgians are considered to be some of the most welcoming and hospitable citizens of the world. Speaking of its people, the citizens of Georgia are called Georgians, and the official language of the nation is called Georgian. Pretty easy to remember, right? Well, even though Georgians make up around 87% of the nation's population, Georgia is also the home to Armenians, Azerbaijanis, Russians, and other citizens of the world. Some of Georgia's most popular destinations include the capital city of Tbilisi, where century-old cultures meet modern advancements and trends. For that picture-perfect summer beach day, we suggest visiting the sea resort city of Batumi. But if sky-high mountaintops are more your style, then check out the regions of Svaneti, Racha, and Guria. When first visiting this underrated country, you might notice stunning and gorgeous Christian Orthodox churches occupying its land, and that is because the official religion of Georgia is Christianity. To be specific, Georgians practice Eastern Orthodox Christianity, similar to the nation of Greece and Cyprus. Now let's check out Georgia's flag. Red and white colors make up this one-of-a-kind flag, also known as the Five Cross Flag. Did you know, Georgia's official flag is very modern and recent? Yep, this red and white flag was adopted in 2004, just 17 years ago. And last but not least, let's take a quick look at the currency. The national currency of Georgia is the Georgian Lari, simply referred to as Lari. One Lari is divided into 100 Tetri, similar to how one dollar is made up of 100 cents. The symbol for a Georgian Lari is the Georgian letter L with two upright dashes. And just like that, we have covered the basics of this stunning and jaw-dropping nation. Now, let's move on to the history segment of our video. Georgia is thought to have one of the oldest civilizations in the world, dating back to 1.7 to 1.8 million years. Fun fact, the earliest European human fossils were actually discovered in the southern region of Georgia, known as Dominici. Many archaeologists and scientists believe that Georgia was also the first country in the world to cultivate grapevines and begin wine production. Evidence dating back to 8,000 years when wine jars were discovered on Georgian land. No wonder Georgians are so proud of their wine culture. Geographically speaking, Georgia was once divided into two distinct parts. The East, known as Iberian, and the West, the Colchian. The Kingdom of Kardli, which was the first Eastern Georgian state, was established and created by the King of Georgia, King Parnavaz I, in the 4th century BC. It was actually King Parnavaz who helped create Georgia's distinct and unique alphabet. In 326 AD, Georgia adapted its religion, Christianity, thanks to a female evangelist, St. Nino. Ever since, religion has remained a major part in Georgia's identity and culture. 
One century later, in the 5th century AD, original hagiographic literature was discovered to be written in the Georgian language. Around that time, Kartli was invaded by Persians, which forced King Gorgasali to move the capital city from Musketa to Tbilisi. And that is how Georgia's modern capital city was created and established. When it comes to the history of this nation, we must mention the time period when Georgia was at the height of its power. In the 11th to 12th centuries, Georgia flourished like never before. The country was led by David IV, dubbed David the Builder, as he defeated the attacks of the Turks and expelled them from the nation. Georgia continued to thrive with the arrival of Queen Tamar in the late 1190s. Along with resisting the attacks of multiple invaders, Georgia went on to become victorious in the major battles of Shamkori and Bassiani. It was during Queen Tamar's reign, when the nation of Georgia was considered to be one of the strongest and powerful in the Caucasus region. And one last memorable piece of history we must mention about 12th century Georgia is the acclaimed medieval poem that made waves worldwide. Author and poet Shota Rustavelli wrote The Knight and the Panther's Skin, a medieval poem that to this day is a huge part of Georgia's culture and national education program. Now, are you ready to hear about a very intriguing 12th century drama? Well, according to historians, Shota Rustavelli was actually in love with Queen Tamar during her reign, and as a sign of his admiration and respect, he wrote the entire poem dedicated to her. And I can't even get a text back! How unfair, right? Let's fast forward a bit to Georgia's recent history and modern revolutions. In 1917, after decades of Russian domination, the Democratic Republic of Georgia was created. In 1920, Russia acknowledged Georgia's independence until 1921, when the Russian army invaded Tbilisi and forced Georgia to become a part of the Soviet Union. After nearly 70 years of being under Russia's wing, Georgia managed to escape the USSR regime. And on May 26, 1991, Georgia regained its independence. Now, modern era Georgia is led by female president Salome Zurabishvili as the country continues to grow as a democratic nation. Congratulations! We have just covered the history of Georgia and some of its memorable culture. Who knew learning history could be so fun and relaxing? Well, now that we know a thing or two about Georgia's history, now let's move on to my favorite segments. Here are some of the most fun, exciting, and interesting facts about Georgia you can amaze your friends with. When it comes to Georgian cuisine, it's very diverse. This nation actually has its own kind of pizza known as hatapuri. But instead of tomato sauce and pepperoni, hatapuri is made from dough, cheese, and eggs. But just like the different types of pizzas, there are many types of hatapuri, named after regions of Georgia they originated from. Have you ever had the feeling of wanting to describe something but couldn't find the right word? We've all been there. Well, Georgian is actually one of the most diverse languages in the world. If you want to describe the day after tomorrow, you can just say Zeg. I don't know about you, but I'm definitely adding Zeg to my vocabulary. Thanks to its reigning kings and queens, Georgia has over 100 castles and fortresses scattered around the country. These giant buildings protected Georgians from enemy invasions. Along with a rich array of main dishes, Georgia is also home to the sweet snacks called Cherskela. Made from walnuts, raisins, and almonds dipped in sweet syrup and grape juice, once you get a taste of church kella, you'll never forget it. Here's another interesting fact. A Georgian song has actually been sent to space. Along with 29 other musical arrangements and pieces, the Georgian folk song, Takrulo, was sent into space on Voyager 2 in 1977. Famous Culture and People Georgia is a country definitely worth exploring, but what is this small nation most famous and known for? As we've seen, Georgia's one-of-a-kind cuisine and language are definitely noteworthy. But you would be surprised to know that Georgia prides itself most on its hospitable and welcoming citizens. The nation actually has a saying that roughly translates to, A guest is a gift from God. So, if you want to feel like a true superstar, we suggest booking a ticket and visiting Georgia. What about some of the most famous people that have their roots in this Caucasus country? If you are a huge NBA fan, then you might recognize the Georgian basketball player Zaza Pachulia, who was a player for the Golden State Warriors and the Dallas Mavericks. Did you know that the Soviet Union leader, Joseph Stalin, was Georgian? Born Yosef Hugashvili, the leader became Stalin at 34 after publishing political articles and journals under that name. And finally, here is another famous face and star as you might recognize. If you love to scroll through TikTok videos on your phone, chances are you've come across the Georgian rapper Bera and his wife Nanuka. The Georgian couple have made waves on social media platforms thanks to their unique and high quality videos. And with over 4.8 million fans and over 100 million likes, Bera and Nanuka are true Georgian celebrities. 
Well, here we have it guys, a quick, entertaining, and informative overview of the nation of Georgia. Now you'll have all the basic info to impress and amaze your friends and family. What did you think of this video? We would absolutely love it if you took time to write a comment down below. Tell us some things we didn't mention about Georgia, and take the chance to educate your peers down in the comment section. Also, what country do you want to see next? As mentioned, we have no order here, we just go with the flow on this one. Give us some tips. And lastly, if you enjoyed this video and can't wait for more, make sure you subscribe to our channel and turn notifications on so we can see you soon again. Goodbye for now, or Nakvandis, as they say in Georgian.